Hello everyone, Planner Girl Meek here. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, hey girl, hey. We are getting ready to do a cozy journaling spread um, using the brand new digital Good Notes kit that is in my shop. It is called She Is Woman. Um, and I am going to be using one of the pictures that is on the last page of the kit as the background. And we're just gonna add some extra elements to it. So I wanted to show you guys how to use that. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, first, we're gonna take this picture here and we're gonna drag and drop it over. It does come in sideways because I didn't remember to fix that, but it's okay, you can just flip it. Um, and then take it here. And it will look a little, well, not that much. We can stretch it a little bit. And depending on how you want your dimensions to look, you can cover the whole page or you can just have it within the confines of the journal so you can still click on your links. So it's been a minute since we've done a cozy journal. <laughs> I'm very excited. <laughs> um, okay, so now we have our background all set and now we're just gonna get cozy and just add in a ton of elements. Um, so first thing that I wanted to do was um, to change this chair. This chair is perfect. It's it's at the right angle. It looks great. I kind of wish this one was um, at an angle as well, but it's not. So this one that's in the kit and it has a matching one at a different angle um, just helps it to pop a little bit. And the thing that I want you guys to remember, if you're getting images off of Pinterest or Google, sometimes um, when you zoom in, they're a little blurry. So um, you can still use them, but adding in different elements to give it like a little pop makes such a big deal. So we are going to add this here. We will be adding another book stack to make that work. And we're gonna kind of put it off to the side. You will see a little bit of the other chair. If you wanna be a perfectionist, you can kind of cover it up but it is up to you. And look at that. It just looks like it's there and maybe there's just stuff underneath the furniture. I mean, you can't even really tell that I added that. So what I wanna do next is to accessorize that corner. And I'm gonna take this end table here, so gorge. And I'm gonna zoom it down because it's going to go here, off to the side a little bit. And boom, perfect. We will accessorize that more in a little bit. We just wanna get the meat and potatoes down first. So next I wanna focus on this area here. I wanna kind of make that stand out a little more because this picture is so small, it is a little blurry. So what I wanna do is take this beautiful picture here, turn it landscape, and place it in there. Sorry, y'all know I get quiet when I am concentrating. <laughs> um, place it in there like that. Does not have to be perfect, but I wanted to use one of the picture frames and this one has quickly become my favorite frame to use. And the thing about it is you could leave it like that, but I wanna stretch it and stretch it down and make it kind of like that shape. And I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna have to cheat and bring that down a little bit. It's all about the illusion, yeah. Kind of wanna see her reading, but I don't think I like it. You can tell she's reading, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, that looks good. I like it. I mean, and you can make it smaller two we don't have to have it yeah that's even better yeah yeah yeah. that looks good so we have that set there um because they had a picture there which i mean technically we don't need to add another picture there but it just it just looks good to have that little pop of color um so now i know that this chair is standing on top of this book stack so i'm going to grab that same book stack um, do I not have it in here? 
Hold on, y'all. I'm going to have to grab the kit. Well, no. I might have it from yesterday's kit. And that's not the one. I'm trying not to stop. I didn't use it. Oh, my goodness. What about? Hmm. Okay, hold on a second, y'all. Let me grab the kit. Okay, I'm back. Um, I pulled the kit up. And the one that I want to use is facing the opposite direction of this one. So it's here. So let's take this and copy. And then we're going to paste it here and tap out. OK, I'm back. Good notes is starting early today. Um, all right, I'm just going to basically just it over that way the, the the foot of the chair isn't on top of the book and that is perfection we are not gonna let that slow us down no 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 so right now i want to focus on this back corner here she is beautiful the way she is let's state that first and foremost but we're just gonna add um some stuff in here to make her pop a little bit so First, I want to take this floral and I'm going to drag it over. Just gorgeous. I did do a crop and crop the stems off the bottom. So when you put it in, it just sits on there perfectly. Oh, I can't. That is, that is, look at that. You see what I mean? It just gives it an extra little oomph of just poppage. Is that a word? poppage <laughs> and then we're going to copy and paste it and put it on this side as well because y'all know i am all about matching and symmetry let me tap out and that is no longer blurry look at that oh my god okay so let's go back to this corner um i'm gonna take this book stack this is from she is peace and we're gonna set these books up here because it looks pretty. And then we're going to take that same book stack that I cropped the flowers off. And we're going to sit it here. And then y'all know how I like to make it look like we have a little bookshelf. So we're going to paste that here. Go out the picture. Because we have to slim this down a little bit just to give it the illusion that we are putting books on a bookshelf. Like so. And then we're going to do another one. Paste. Go into picture mode. And put that one off to the side there. And we are done with that corner just like that. So pretty. I mean, I was thinking of putting florals there, but I think it might be too much to cover that up. We'll see when we're done. Okay, so the next thing I want to do is work on the corner here. So I'm going to take this one and drag it over. And I've already cropped a little bit of it off um, in the corner so it can sit flush. I'm just going to put it here. I don't want it to be like so. Trying to get it to look. Yeah, yeah, that looks. That looks this one looks a little shorter. Like that. All right, and then let's bring it up a little bit right there. Okay, that looks good. Then I want to make sure that it's sitting right against that line. Love it. Love it so much. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to take a book stack um, and we're going to place it on there. Like so. Y'all, this is so beautiful. Oh, my goodness. So beautiful. So, so, so beautiful. Okay, I'm just going to stick. This one's just going to have some book stacks on it. Let's stretch it out a little bit. 
man, if I can get some books like this, like even if they're fake books, just for decor on my bookshelf. Oh, oh my God. That would be heaven. Heaven. You know, why did I want to do that? Let me thinking out loud here. Hold on a second. Let me see something. Let me see something. Because I don't think it will look bad. Maybe not stretched out. What the? Yeah, that, yeah. We're going to use that. I like that better. Um, And then I think I had the same one over here. But I'm wondering if I should do the flip version of it. Because it's on the other side. We'll come back to it. Okay, so next I wanted to add her. No, I'm going to add her in the end. No, I need to add her now. Okay, let me add her now. She is a part of one of the doubles. Um, and I just cropped her out. Um, she's further enough in the background to where I'll have to make her that big. Oh my gosh, so cute. So cute. Okay, and so then I want to take the iPad and put the iPad on this cushion. And it's going to kind of cover her shoe a little bit. Like so. Place that there. Y'all, it's just something about just taking this stuff and just placing it. It's just, that's the cozy part of it, you know? And I'm going to move her a little bit because I want to see, yeah, her shoe. Okay, and then we're going to take the kids and we're going to put the kids in here. <laughs> oh my God, they're so cute. Okay, um, we're going to put the kids kind of on. I mean, I don't want them covering that so much. They are littles. That, is that where I want it? I think that's where I want it. Yes, that's perfect. I love that. Oh my goodness, are you guys enjoying this? Are you guys enjoying this? I hope you guys are. It's been so long since we've done a cozy journal. So I, ooh, yeah, girl. Okay, so next we're going to bring in this beauty. And y'all know I love that she's wearing brown. Oh my God. Okay, we're going to place her. I need to be a little bigger. Place her down at the bottom here. All right, let's kind of move her there. Like so. Love. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. So next, um, I am going to put a pair of heels next to her because I'm visioning that she also came um, to the party in heels, but she was like, oh, this is for the birds. <laughs> so she took her shoes off and it does match. You see the brown in the shoe. It matches her outfit. So don't come for me. I'm wondering if I should make it around the same size. And should I put it next to the books? Because I wouldn't imagine the shoes being behind her. Because she should she could trip. Okay. All right. We'll move that in a little bit. Let's work on. So we got the kids. We got the girl in the background. Let's work on this table. And for the table, we're going to grab the vase and book. Just love this so, oh my gosh, so much. These flowers kind of remind me of the flowers that I've been seeing at um, Lowe's, the hardware store. Um, people have talked about it on TikTok. They're fake, like paper flowers. Um, and they're supposed to be like Lowe's version of forever flowers or roses. Um, but those flowers kind of look like that, y'all. I love it so much. It's, uh, oh. <laughs> okay. So we've done that. We've basically gotten that center portion of the room done. Let's bring over one of these 
book stacks and we're gonna paste it and I want it to be skinny and tall like that and that area looks good and then I want to take so we're gonna have to go back to she is woman and we need the opposite direction of this so I'm gonna copy that and paste it zoom in tap out I've noticed that I like resizing stuff in the picture mode because when it's in that lasso mode, when you um, drop it in, it's blurry and it messes with my vision. So that's why I did that. Um, oh, I know what I'm missing. Um, this lamp, I grabbed just the shade part. I just cropped it. It's the same one here, which I'm going to use in a second. Um, and I just cropped the bottom portion off here and I just stuck it on this one just to give it more of the color oh the color vibes and it's just perfection just one of the bigger shade and just put that over there y'all now why does it look like the light turns on and off when you click on the picture is it me like is it me Oh my God, it's so cool. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I think we're done with that section. It looks great. Um, I think I even want to put a book stack right there. Let's see how everything looks once we're done. We are almost done, y'all. Okay. So next, we are going to work in this corner here just to try to give that a little bit more pop. And I want to take this beautiful lamp that we were just talking about. Look at this. I mean, y'all. So we're going to take her and put her on the table. I'm just taking this for measurement's sake. And it's going to go kind of go off because the table is going off a little bit. And then we are going to take this book stack. It's a different one. And we're gonna put it on the table next to the lamp. And perfect. Next, we're gonna grab our handbag here, drop it over. <laughs> Guys, I, I need to get somebody to make me a purse that looks like this. It's just gorgeous. Okay, um, we're just gonna place the handbag here. We are not going to place it on the floor. Is that too big? I think that's the perfect size for that bag. And oh my goodness, y'all, I think, I think we're done. Like, I think we have all the things. So let's see if we want to add anything based off of what I originally did. Um, I'm still thinking this corner here. So maybe a book stack. Let's see. No, go back. Gotta pay attention sometimes, girl. Okay. Because I mean, it's all about the book stacks in here. Oh, I like it. I like that. Oh my God. I think that's it. Um, The shoes, maybe the shoes we'll put next to the chair. Because her purse is there, the shoes are on the floor. Yeah, that's good. And we can't make that any smaller because I placed it in it when I designed the page. So I think, you guys, I think that's it. This is looking a little off centered to me. Let me just think. Let me bring this over a little bit there. No, what are you doing? Oh, I brought it down too far. Hold on, we got a lot of stuff to fix here. It's still going. Are we going to stress about it? Oh, that's way better. Okay. And then we're going to take this and place it here. And with that, we are going to close out that part and tap to make this bigger. And y'all. We have a cozy journaling spread all done. 
And oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Oh, there's more to come. I've already designed the next one. So you guys can be on the lookout for that. But I promised you guys yesterday that I would have this done and it will be posted on Friday. I'm doing it on um, today's Thursday. Um, I do have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. So I didn't want to break my promise. So I went ahead and did it today. But oh my God, I love it so much. I love it when the background is all set for you. You can just add in all the things and ugh. I love it so much. You guys, Cozy Journaling is back. Ah, I love it so much. So if you guys like this video, please leave me a pink heart um, in the comment section. Let me know what Cozy Journals you are expecting from this beautiful She Is Woman uh, sticker kit. The kit is in the shop. Links will be down below. Thank you all that have purchased it already. And thank you in advance to those that will grab it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and for sticking with me um, through my healing process of this COVID that I got in March that has, that was, I am not going to speak it into existence, um, but thank you guys for your prayers and for sticking in there with me. I told you guys I was going to bring you some cozies and I'm so excited to be back doing cozy journaling. It's, it's the therapy that I didn't know I needed. And when I started doing this, it had been a blessing and I'm so happy that it blesses you all. So before I get on my little rampage of talking, talking, I'm going to let you guys go. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to carve out some cozy time for yourself. Watch a cozy movie, read a cozy book, watch Planner Girl Meet Cozy video playlist. It will be at the end of the video that will help my channel out so much. Please subscribe. Join the cozy side of journaling. Thank you to all my new subscribers and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.